to Halloween this year, I thought I'd be Sharon Needles. What does Sharon Needles have in common with Jesse J and Taylor Swift? I'll get to that in one second. Whenever I do someone for the first time, I always do a trial run, which is what this is. So here's how I got to this point. As always, I start by having a shower, giving myself a good shave, and moisturizing. Then it's time to put on a skull cap and get started. First thing I've done is covered up my eyebrows. There are a lot of different ways to do that, so I'm going to include a couple of links to tutorials down in the description below. I start by covering the whole face with white base and translucent powder. Next, I outline the lips with a black eyeliner pencil. Then I contour the nose up into the eyebrow area. This will become the crease of the eye. Add lots of contouring to the cheeks, the jawline, the eyes. Add some lipstick, eyebrows, and a cleft in the chin. Add some liquid eyeliner and eyelashes and thicken the brows. Finally, add a white wig with a spider hat and pop in some white contact lenses. And this is the finished results. So back to Taylor Swift and Jessie J. What do they have in common with Sharon Needles? Well, up until today, I've never tried doing any of them. Now that I've done Sharon, the question is, for my next music parody video, should I do Taylor Swift's Welcome to New York or should I do Jessie J's Bang Bang? It's up to you. Leave a comment in the comment section down below and we'll see which one gets the most votes. To see my parody of All About the Bass, you can click right there or there's a link in the description down below. Did you know that I had a CHTV app? It's available for iPhones and for Android and there's a link in the description down below with all the other links to my social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, you name it, I've got it all down below. Thanks for watching and have a happy Halloween. And definitely tell me which video you want me to do next. And please don't say do a Madonna share or Lady Gaga music parody because they haven't come up with any new music recently. As soon as Madonna's new album comes out, you know I'll be parodying it.